but it was the upper reaches of the river which became from the Victorian era the favorite resort of the new leisure classes. That's the image of the wooded reaches of the river today. Edwardian steamers like the Windsor Bell have been refurbished for pleasure trips. It's possible to take a boat way up river because of all the locks and weirs that have been built to bypass the shallows and keep a good depth of water. I was only about 18 at the time. I had orders to take the boat to Skindles Maidenhead. When I got there, my orders was to uh, take the boat out every night under the manager of Skindles and uh, take her up through Bolter's Lock, laid under Clevedon Woods, and what carried on there with the, uh, with the gentleman and the young girls was hard to say, but I had to be like the three brass monkeys, say nothing, know nothing, and hear nothing. It was in the Edwardian period that the leafy reaches around Marlow and Maidenhead had their heyday. Our parents and the Richmond watermen used to fetch their children and wives, and they used to tow 30 punts roughly up to Enley behind a little steamer. Well, when we got through Bolter's Lock, we used to go into the meadows. Uh, the parents used to light a big fire and sit all around. And also us little reluctions after having a swim and that, we used to go in the boat and sleep head to towel. And uh, they'd be having a good old sing song ashore. But then the next day we'd carry on to Enley. When we got to Enley, we laid in the meadows, put up our little old tents, what we had, bell tents and that, and the fathers used to let the pumps out for Enley regatta, which was a great week for all us youngsters. And uh, that was the life we had them days. <laughs> Some of the Victorian class distinctions on the river were beginning to break down in the 20s and 30s. I used to belong to Barnsbridge Rowing Club, and as you know, it was a, a professional rowing club. It was called tradesmen them days, distinction between tradesmen and amateur. Anyone who was a, a gas fitter or a man that used his hands or a labourer, he, he was classed as a tradesman. Well, when you went to Enley, it, was, it wasn't an Enley Royal Regatta, it was Enley Town Regatta. When you went to Reading, that was Reading Town Regatta. Hammersmith was the same. You was barred from any amateur range. And, uh,